Hello everyone, this is Richard with uh, Mile62 Trail Running Channel. Uh, today's video is a little bit different. Uh, I want to do a, a short tribute to John Meadows. We all know him as Mountain Dog. He's one of my favorite weightlifting YouTubers. Um, learned a great deal from him. You know, we often talk about in running how uh, running slow can make you run faster. This is the Maffetone method. And weightlifting, there are many camps too. Some think that you should run, you should train very heavy. And others think that it's not necessary. But you can tell by John, he's a very big guy. He's a bodybuilder his whole life, over 30 years. And uh, I think 20 years, he was a competitive bodybuilder. Um, let's listen to, uh, this is one of my favorite clips of his. Let's listen to it for about 20 seconds. You set aside an arm day. Yes, I'm advocating it just a straight arm day because it makes sense. And that's going to help your biceps, number one. All right, now, number two. Um, now, I'm telling you, in this video like what comes to my mind first and the other thing one of the first things that comes to my mind as well is it's how heavy do you train your biceps you know we all believe in progressive overload and trying to get a little bit stronger but there's something about <laughs> your biceps you got to be careful um, if you're going real heavy all the time there's a very high likelihood that you'll get tendonitis in your elbows and I bet a high percentage of you watching this video have probably had some kind of elbow issues in the past. Exactly. Um, I've had tennis, tendonitis in the elbows, or more, more commonly called tennis elbow. And um, about a year ago, I started lifting much lighter, and I've seen a lot of progress. My arms are getting bigger, and I've gained a lot of strength. And um, I incorporate a lot of light uh, weightlifting in my uh, running program, cross training. Um, so a big part of my cross training is weight training. Um, John is one of the, one of the guys that were, was, was very humble and uh, very easygoing coach on, um, on YouTube and, uh, which is much different than a lot of the weightlifting channels. A bunch of the guys are kind of arrogant and, uh, um, just, just didn't really, I didn't like watching them. But John was great. I've watched almost all of his videos and some of them multiple times. And uh, unfortunately, he passed away on Sunday. Um, he had been having problems with uh, blood clotting. I think he had a heart attack about a year ago. And uh, he had a blood aneurysm on Sunday. And I think he passed away in his sleep. So um, I just wanted to do a short tribute to him. I never met him. I know he lives in Ohio. I live in Texas. But a great guy, and uh, he has two children and a wife. Um, so if they're watching this video, I'd like to say that I learned a lot from John. And uh, I hope you keep his videos on the YouTube because I think they're very educational. He's really a great guy. And you, you could tell it by the way he carries himself in the videos and treats other people. But anyways, uh, God bless uh, John Meadows, uh, a.k.a. Mountain Dog. I suggest if you're in weightlifting and you don't know who John is, you search Mountain Dog uh, YouTube channel. Very, very good channel. Uh, a lot of videos on anything you ever want to know about weightlifting. But anyways, everyone have a good day and uh, uh, take care.